your case, what was your defining moments throughout your career? What changed you? Tough one. <laughs> I think I think I would separate out, I would separate those two things out. Okay. As in, what's defining moments and what actually changed me. Okay. Um, defining moments would be making the Ohio final for the first time. That was one of the you know big moments, making the the U.S. Nationals for the first time. Um, what made it so special? I know there is more, but what made it so defining for you? Is it constellation that you you achieved it? All your efforts were repaid. I'm gonna go with the stunning arrogance of it all. Come on. Okay. Because, no, because look, when 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 you're thinking about what you think you should be doing, yeah. you have to hold in your head as a competitor this this amazing dichotomy between you deserve it, and of course you should be there, and also how terrible you are that you need to get better. Sure. So it's, all of us. All uh, of yeah, us. I mean, so you have to walk on the floor believing you are the best, and then you watch a video and convince that, you know, why is that, that, that absolutely incompetent person beating you? And at the same time, realize that you're looking at yourself and like, well, what am I doing? This is terrible. So there's this, this like uh, almost bipolar nature to, to what we do when we're dancing. And making Ohio final for the first time was probably one of the, um, it's funny, in my head I knew that, that that was a possibility, but I kind of expected it, and then as it was happening, it was more memorable because of how that happened. You know, they called the seven couple final, didn't, and I just kind of knew. So that was kind of okay. the big deal. That was the first major final I'd made. And then, then later was making the USCC final, Again, we had just lost the Rising Star earlier in the year because that was when they had split yeah, Rising yeah, yeah. Star from the Open. And so to go in and make the final, but not just be at the bottom to make the final and place, I think we came in at fifth. And that was just, that was kind of vindication in a way. So that was, That's awesome. yeah, that, I mean, that was, you have your ups and downs and then what do you do? But is it, uh, did you have a thought in your head that I want to make the final? And if you did, is it messing up your dancing oh yeah I mean of course I wanted to make the final I mean who doesn't and it, it, you, you go out to dance and look if we're all lying to ourselves no, and I, I mean like you you not you're trying to separate yourself you know from that thought or is that thought was always dominant in your head well no I mean that that's that's we all have goals and those are gonna be what are driving us so is that the overall goal that's driving me as I'm dancing no Dancing was different, it, you know, the, yeah, you have your goals and those are the things you want to achieve, but when you actually go to dance, uh, I would say the best performance is when I wasn't trying to do that. And you know, we, you hear many times the, the teachers say, don't go compete. Oh, you were competing. Well, what, okay, does, yeah, what, is that, yeah, what does that, yeah, yeah. what does that mean? I don't even know, yeah. I still don't know what that means. Uh, I think- I will tell you, I will tell you after. Yeah, yeah, please, please. <laughs> yeah, but I think, I think in a way it's because you're thinking about results oriented. So yes. what you do is not based on your feeling and your, your okay. love of it. So what did you do instead? Instead of thinking about results, what did you do? Now that goes back away. Um, from, from, for me, dancing was very spiritual. Okay. And I, that, to explain it any other way, I don't know how. Um, to transcend a moment and be able to be in a moment of uh, just pure being. Nothing else is happening, nothing else matters. It's happening and then it's over. And, and, and very, very few things in life allow you the experience of that. That's you know, awesome. and if you can, you can get past all the mental head games that you play with yourself and what else we're trying to do out there, it, it really is special. And that, that, I think to this day, still holds true. That's awesome, dude. Thank you. Do you miss it? That aspect of it, yeah. But in everything else, no. Okay. That's, that's fair enough, you know. Ladies and gentlemen, we will be back.